Well, the community has many platforms uh, to handle disagreements and uh, to handle also conflicts between uh, member states. Uh, this is a, now a big family with six partner states, uh, which do not have necessarily the same background. Uh, so it is uh, as it is in any family. Sometimes uh, brothers and sisters do quarrel. We know that. Uh, actually, that is part of uh, the integration. Uh, in that sense that originally people present differences and uh, you know, integration helps settle this uh, divergences and also settle some, some conflicts. We have uh, as a main platform our Council of Ministers uh, to which we report all the problems that we are experiencing in all the pillars of integration. And uh, political matters are always, also, are always reported during Council of Ministers. And uh, the issues between countries in EAC have really been handled at every meeting. Uh, they have been discussed and uh, they are being resolved through diplomatic channels. Uh, so our ministers of foreign affairs, uh, our ministers of public security, uh, our ministers of defense have met at least twice a year in Arusha. Uh, so we, we have a, a sober approach. We don't, uh, as you may have seen, when we deal with these matters, we, it is not done uh, in front of the media. Uh, we are in a meeting room and the people discuss, uh, present their views on uh, some of the issues. And uh, up until when we agree and when we don't agree, uh, we continue the discussions at the next meeting. We also, uh, as Secretariat and especially myself as a Secretary General, uh, I also consult uh, with the ministers uh, individually, and I meet also with the presidents. Um, uh, on the issue, for example, Burundi and Rwanda, I have, uh, I have had the opportunity to discuss one-on-one -on -one with uh, President Kunuziza, and we talked about the issues with uh, the neighboring country of Rwanda. And uh, last year in November, exactly on the 17th of November, I met with President Kagame in Kigali, and we talked again about the, the relations between the two countries. So the, some progress is being made uh, in our discussions and uh, I think uh, for sure uh, our diplomacy uh, and uh, all our structures are working towards the resolution of issues between Burundi and Rwanda. And we have a similar approach with uh, you know, the issues which have been uh, uh, shown uh, most of the time in the media, the issues between uh, Rwanda and, uh, and Uganda. Uh, so the, it is important to know that uh, regardless the issues we are talking about, uh, our ministers, our senior officials, our permanent secretaries meet on a regular basis to discuss customs union issues, uh, common market. As uh, you know, recently now we all uh, instituted uh, an EAC e-passport uh, and all our countries accepted. We recently uh, agreed on the form of a federation that we want to, to go into. And uh, you know, Burundi, Rwanda, Uganda, Kenya, uh, the United Republic of Tanzania, the Republic of South Sudan all agreed uh, that they are willing to get into a confederation. So. That means that the willingness uh, to build together a community is there from all the countries. And of course, these tensions are, are, are there. Uh, you know, uh, integration is, is really uh, is a process. So these issues uh, will be resolved.